Hi, this is Chris Gould with Geeks On Tour. Are you interested in Bitcoin? I know I am. Bitcoin just might be the future of money for our world. It's time to learn about it now. Bitcoin is digital money, so you need a digital wallet if you want to get you some. I'm going to demonstrate how you do that. If you want a Bitcoin wallet, there's lots to choose from. We choose this one called Blue Wallet because we have some experience with it. You can find it on the website called bluewallet.io. It can be installed on a mobile device or on a computer, but I think a wallet should be mobile, so we're going to put it on an iPhone. First, you open your App Store or your Play Store on Android. It's the same thing. You install the Blue Wallet app. You create a Bitcoin wallet within the app, and then it is very important to write down your keys. Those are 12 words and keep them in a safe place. If anyone gets those keys, they can steal your wallet. So let me show you how. So here is my iPhone. I'm going to open up the App Store and search for Blue Wallet. That's it. I have installed it on other devices, so it shows that it's in the cloud. Yours will probably say get there. It is free. And you can read all about it here. I just want it on this device, on this iPhone. But I want you to see it from a home screen. So I'm going to go out to the home screen. There is the app for Blue Wallet. You open up the app. The app can actually hold multiple wallets. So you open up the app and then you add a wallet. There's three choices. We're just going to choose a plain Bitcoin wallet and I'm going to call it Chris's demo wallet. And I just want Bitcoin and create. Here are those 12 words. You need to write them down, including the numbers, because if you ever lose your wallet, you need these 12 words in this order. So there, I have written down these words, and these are I have to put this in a very safe place. It's like the key to your safe deposit box. Now, why am I showing you this? Well, my wallet is going to be empty, right? I might put a little bit in it just to play with, but I am going to encourage you to steal my wallet. If you open a wallet and import with these 12 words, you will be stealing my wallet. So, okay, I wrote it down. And I now have a wallet. It has nothing in it. And I want you to notice also, in creating this wallet, I was not asked for my email address, my name, my address, any kind of bank account or credit card, no identifying information whatsoever. Getting a digital wallet can be just like buying a leather wallet at a store. It is just a holder. If you want to put some Bitcoin into your wallet, you're going to need to exchange dollars for Bitcoin. And there are institutions called exchanges, cryptocurrency exchanges, that will do that for you. Coinbase is the one I use, and that will be in the next video. Right now, I want to go back to the wallet and show you if you actually tap on the wallet, it gives you the option right here to buy Bitcoin. But what's What's actually, ha it's not as easy as it looks. <laughs> What's actually happened is this is taking you out to MoonPay, which is an exchange. But let me just show you. I tap buy Bitcoin and continue. Well, you could tell it how much, how much you want to buy. It's assuming 300. And, I'll, you know, you might say no just uh, 20. <laughs> the minimum is 30. Okay. So the minimum is 30. And then done and continue. And you're, you are going to have to give your email, your, I think your phone number and your mailing address and a credit card in order to check out with MoonPay. Nothing wrong with that, but I'm going to use Coinbase. So that will be in the next video. 
So that's all there is to creating a Bitcoin wallet. You just get it from your App Store or your Play Store, install it on your phone, write down your keys, those 12 words. Now you have a wallet which somebody could send you Bitcoin to, or you could go to an exchange and exchange dollars for Bitcoin yourself. Mm -hmm.